Hey guys, here's my next uh, group of Easter cards, and this first set's gonna be monochromatic. Monochromatic means all similar shades of the same color. So this is a blue, and I decided to leave the wooden sentiment, um, the natural color, to kind of match the bunny being a natural color. All kinds of layering, beaded trim, lace, there's lace actually poking out the bottom there, the blue bow, and then when you open it up, ta-da. Okay. Then we have this one. These are all going to be the same image, just different uh, style of decorating the card. Um, so we have white flowers on this one, and we have a paper bow underneath layered with a um, oh, what do they call it? An applique bow. And then I had a blue egg there that I put in the center. On this side, I, this, this is like a little plastic egg, and I cut it in half so I could use um, each half. And then there's this one with a paper bow in the center with the egg and then the flowers on the edge. So, you know, I have the pearl trim. I have lace back behind here. Just honestly, really simple, um, simple layering techniques. All right, now we're gonna go pink. So I found these images online, free images, and um, the little bunnies in the teacup teacups were just adorable. So my flower cluster here, a paper bow layered with a, an applique bow. And then this opens up and it says Easter. All right. Then we've got this cute little bunny in a teacup. We've got some flowering and I used some, um, some dyes, lots of layering. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine layers on that card. It opens up like that. Super love this bunny. And um, another paper bow. This, uh, ah, this paper collection is a printable collection uh, from Shabby Art Boutique. So if you're interested in that, opens up like that. All my cards I stamped on the back. Sorry, my cards fell over here. Here is another, you know, it almost looks like a mouse, but it is a bunny. And um, again, some dyes, my flower cluster, bow, and then it opens up like that. So it is a lot more effort to put stuff on the inside, but I think it's kind of a little delight for whoever's getting the card that just the outside of the card is not um, all that's, um, decorated. So we have this cute little bunny, super cute with the little daisies. So I added some yellow daisies, some, a little bit of die cuts and, um, I added two eggs to this one. Look at those pretty eggs. And then that opens up like that. So this bunny, I decided to put a little hat on her. I used one of my little sheep. It just says Easter. And then lots of layering down here with appliques underneath, then the flowers, and then little hearts. And this opens up like that. So you don't have to do anything elaborate on the inside. I mean, like I did some die cuts on the inside, but you really, you really don't have to. It just needs to be paper. So again, this bunny has a little hat on. See, so just, you know, putting the paper on the inside makes, makes it nicer when they open it up. And don't forget to stamp your cards. All right, that is it. All these cards are for sale. I do sell my cards for $15 a piece if anybody's interested. 
But what I'm going to do now is package these up in clear cellophane, price them, and put them for sale in my store. So thanks for watching. Happy Scrappy Day. Bye, guys.